on today's episode i will be sharing with you how to stop being shy remember there is a difference between being an introvert yes and being shy are you shy are you scared to speak when you are with other people when you meet new people are you scared to interact with others in public are you that person if you are then you're shy because an introvert can socialize when they want to when an introvert wants to socialize they will socialize when they want to talk to other people they will talk to other people they don't just talk because they don't they don't want to talk but a shy person wants to talk but they don't know how to they're scared they don't know what people will think they're like what do people think when i when i speak what of if i get it wrong what of if they don't like what i say what of if i make mistakes what of if i get it wrong omg what of if they don't like me that is a shy person you know i used to be shy i used to be very shy growing up but i worked on myself you know i, I didn't do i didn't do it all by myself i think my mom helped as well my mom helped my dad helped and i did most of the work so you have to work on yourself you have to once you identify that you're shy you have to work on yourself work on yourself it's going to take time it's not a quick fix it's going to take time but it's doable and you can do it you can do it okay remember it is very normal to be shy you know it's very normal it's very you've got a lot of people out there who are shy but there's one thing you have to remember when you're shy um you've got a lot to say but because you're scared of what people will think you don't share what you have to share you keep it there you don't speak to anybody you have problems you don't want to tell people because you're shy because you you're you're because sometimes you think this is another thing with shy people most shy people i've met they think people can read their minds like you should have known that i was going through that no no one no one is a right mind reader no one can read your minds that is why you have to work on yourself you have to work on yourself as soon as you identify that you're shy please start working on yourself from that day if you can otherwise you have to draw a plan on you know on how to work on yourself you know one thing you should remember is that we are all humans we are all humans we're all the same outside not outside <laughs> did i just say outside we are all the same inside maybe not outside of course we all don't look identical do we no we don't no not not outside we are all the same inside we've all got veins we've all, we've all got blood running through our veins so we are all the same inside and it's okay to make mistakes remember this one it's okay to make mistakes we're all the same inside it's okay to make mistakes and what is making you shy is because you're focusing on you too much you're focusing on yourself you're focusing on your insecurities you're focusing on the mistakes you might make you're judging yourself too much that is why you're being shy if you can stop all these things stop judging yourself stop focusing so much on yourself stop um thinking about the things that you might say wrong the things you might do wrong stop it stop it you know when you get in a room with people focus on them ask open-ended questions ask questions what is your name where did you come from where are you coming from how long did it take you you know it depends on where you are there are questions you can ask like if you are in the uk where i am the weather is always sometimes we've got four seasons in one day so you can start by speaking about the weather that is a 
brilliant a wonderful icebreaker to use anytime any day in the uk it's the weather talk about the weather you know sometimes i'll just go i have everything in my bag because when i was coming it was so hot i had my 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 i had my rain boots on and everyone would just start laughing you know so that is uh, that's an eye break icebreaker if you're in the uk if you're in another country look for what you can say that everyone can relate to and use it as an icebreaker whenever you meet other people so that takes away the focus from you you know and then you can ask questions you know share stories share stories it mustn't be personal stories share stories about your journey how you travel to meet them the, meet the people you're with you know you can talk about the room you can talk about your 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 cab journey your uber journey there's a lot you can talk about you know but one thing um that i think you should know is that you can work on overcoming shyness you can do it and you have to do it in today's world you have to be able to go out there and talk you have to be able to go out there speak to people if there's a problem somewhere you have a problem you have to be able to express yourself in your relationship i met someone who said they couldn't um they couldn't um communicate with your girlfriend he had a partner that he so loved but the relationship was so boring because she was so shy she couldn't express herself she couldn't share her views he didn't he didn't know what um she was thinking about she uh, he didn't know what she was thinking about at any particular point in time she sometimes she would get angry he wouldn't know why he would ask she would not talk so when you're being um, um when you're shy um you push a lot of good things away because you don't talk because people don't know what you want because you have problems you can share them with people so please work on this you can one day at a time one step at a time start by speaking to people on your street you can say good morning it could be your classmate at uni start by saying hello it's one person you know just say hello it could be at work speak to your colleague it could be on your street speak to that lady with the dog talk about the dog how about that talk about the dog oh my god you know talk about the dog ask her about her dog ask 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 her about her dog you know how old is your dog speak to people it could be in the supermarket speak to someone oh my god you know this is the uh, the butter i use is that what you use they'll go oh yes how long have you been using it they will tell you they will tell you and in the supermarket a lot of people want to talk so they will tell you oh i've been using it try it why don't you give it a go so speak to people start the conversation you know sometimes you just say hello to someone and then they just start they won't they won't even let you go you know i met this girl at the supermarket um that was about three weeks ago i just said hello how are you it was her hair i was like oh i love your hair that was it today we are friends <laughs> hey hello uh, you know it was just her hair she was she was like oh i said i like your hair so she started talking about the hair when she made the hair who made the hair you know how long it took she talked a lot she shared a lot about the hair so if you're shy please please don't focus on yourself start by you know talking to to people okay i think that's all i've got to share with you today thanks very much for sharing your time with me hope you did enjoy the video don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this and if this is your first time seeing me i'm cecilia mbula uh, also known as lady c thanks very much for sharing your time with me today thanks very much again don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel don't forget have you subscribed go on go on press the button go on have you done it <laughs> thank you and bye bye for now bye okay let me share with you my I got this hand cream. I got this hand cream. 
that i love 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 i got this hand cream